Pretty good. Hey, we got more coming up. All right. Adorable. Adorable. Really? $26. What? Three easy payments of $8.81. Try not to smile. <laughs> if, if someone comes to your, to your home and they don't smile when they see these, they need to leave. Because they're I just know. not nice enough, right? I agree. This is like an instant, like, oh, come on, what's going on there? And as you take a look at our little critters here, our friendly little critters, you take a look at their faces, take a look at how they're kind of feeling good about each other, right? And then you take a look at the subtle kind of second surprise, which is what it creates. And that's a heart in the middle, brand new today. Which one would you like? Would you like our friend, the bunny rabbits? You can get them. Would you like our friend, the kitty cats, right here? Mm -hmm. Most limited for the cat lovers. And here is our lovely, talented, adorable puppy dogs. Look at the other side. And even a heart with the tails. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I go down to Plow and Hearts two times a year to talk with the designers and see what they've come up with when I saw these. I literally fell in love with these because I am an animal lover, but also the fact that they took these animals and then crafted them so beautifully. They're inspired by carved stone. These are made out of resin. You can put these outside if you'd like. I would enjoy them inside as well because I just think they're so precious. You don't want to miss seeing them every day. This, the, just the subtle fact that they're just showing each other affection and love by touching their heads. But the fact that the shape creates a heart inside, I think is just absolutely precious. So that's the cat. And then we saw the dog and you saw the heart on the dog's tails. And then this is the bunnies. You'll see I'm spinning them around just so that you can see how pretty they are all the way around. And there's the heart. So sweet. $8.81, three times 200 people shopping now in the moment. Share your story, by the way, if you love Plow and Hearth or if you're picking these up right now, come on in. Uh, these are great. Again, the way these are, tell me a little bit, if you would, yes. about the design team. Like who's, who's making the Plow, like the Plow and Hearth is the brand, but you've right. got, there isn't one look here. I mean, you've right. got a zillion different categories, different looks, different colors. Who, yeah, who are these people? Well, you know what? They're, they're a wonderful team headed by Janice. And um, she has the most creative mind as well as all the folks that help her out and Rich and the others. They come up with the most amazing designs. They're always searching the world to find really cool inspiration and great ideas. These were inspired by carved rocks that they saw. And then they got to thinking, you know, so many of our viewers love animals. Let's create something that that gives them that love of animals and that look. The thing about Paul and, Paul and Hearth though, is you take a look at our bunnies, by the way, they are now officially in the lead. Uh, these are brand new. Is that Plow and Hearth doesn't, they don't knock off. They don't That copy. is so true. This they is are true. leading the design. Like, like You're they're right. The, they're the one that other people want to interpret, right? You are so right. Because they're a real design team. They really are a design team. They're not just, you know, like you said, going somewhere and saying, ah, we'll just, you know, tweak Do that. Do that one and in the it. red. Exactly. Right. They they craft these things. They come up with the ideas. Like I said, they travel the world to look and get inspiration. You know, you're seeing the set behind us. This is also Plow and Hearth. They do decorative. They do functional. They do beautiful furniture. They do, I mean, I'm always amazed. When I go down, I am so honored to represent this brand because I know the quality. I know what goes into this. I, oh, look at that. Oh my gosh, how pretty is that? I know that they are coming up with ideas so that you have something unique and different in your home. You don't want to just have the same old thing that everybody else has down the road, right? You want people to come to your home, see your garden and say, wow, Rick's garden is absolutely spectacular. I wonder where he got that really cool statue. Mm -hmm. I wonder how he put together that beautiful look in his garden. And that's what makes you kind of proud as a gardener, as a homeowner, that you have something different. And Plow and Hearth helps you do that. I always say it's like they went to that juried craft show. They met with that artisan. They're the ones who brought it home and crafted it so that you have something special. So that you have something special. Now, I, although I'm not a gardener, okay, my, 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 my late grandmother, though, Veronica, my dad's mom, had the most beautiful garden in town. And that was her canvas. 
Yes. yes the way she exactly. designed that, mm -hmm. that was hers. And I had to mow her lawn. And I <laughs> had to make sure and rake all of the, like, right, all the, all the, all the clippings right. out. Right? When I clipped, like, I couldn't get it on any of the white rocks or any of the things that she had. So this is part of, 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 of her being the creator and being the designer. You yes. take a look at the whole and you created that. And these little pieces are something you don't want to be too ostentatious, new to the top. Just these little subtle touches show off who you are. They're, they're an expression of who you are. Exactly. And you're creating, you're painting your canvas out in your outdoor space. No doubt. You are creating your happiness, your joy. And your, Plown Hearth. Your is, flowers, your designs, and your accessories. That's right. Yeah. And Plown Hearth is it's, helping you do that. It's jewelry for your yard. Yes. We're good here, aren't we? We are, what are good. What are our choices? Go through it, Nancy. So we have our darling little bunnies. Look at them, just reaching into each other. So cute, the pink in their ears. About 10 and a half inches high. Yes. Our kitty cats, for those of you who are cat lovers. Mm -hmm. Look at the sweet details here. And then our dogs. And I need to turn them around because you have to see that these, all of them are darling from all sides. But if you're a dog lover, look at this. Even their little tails create a heart. <laughs> so cute. Can we take these around and take them to some spots? You so can I go can wherever you want. All righty. I think I'm going to take my dogs and my bunnies. Let's go to the table. I'm going to walk over to our table. Um, and I do want you to know, this is a plow and hearth table. They do statuary. They do tables. This is a plow and hearth table? This tables and chairs. So I'm having Easter brunch outside. But I want some bunnies on my table because I think that is absolutely That's darling. That's pretty nice. Isn't that cute? And That's pretty nice. Voila, you have something very instantly, something easy to do, and you've got Easter. And if then you I'm want our friend the bunnies, by the way, they're going very quickly. Are These are brand spanking new today. Fewer than a thousand in the bunnies by Easter. They're there. Easter brunch, Easter table, or just because you love them in every spring, they're going to be there again. And what have you got now? I've got my dogs. Let's see. I, I always like something at the front door. That is kind of my hallmark. I love to have something darling, pretty plants, some statuary, a nice rug at my front door. So there I'm going to put my dogs because I'm also a dog lover. Mm -hmm. So I want people to know when they walk into my house that, that I am a dog lover. So I like to have that piece of statuary right there. They fit in anywhere. Again, they're fine to use outside. Don't worry about that. But you know what? If you don't have an outdoor space and you just want to put this on your center island, you want to put it maybe on a little patio or you have a fireplace, they're still great there too. Uh, and the last minute and a half, they're brought to you by Plow and Hearth. So wherever you want to put them, you can. Your choice. They're made of resin. They're okay yes. to be outside, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. They're made to look like carved stone, but they're made out of resin. And so they're fine to be outside. They've got some texture to them. So we'll look at that in the bunny, just because I do want you to know that they have sort of... Um, a distressed look to them, maybe like they've been carved and they've sat outside for a little while. So don't worry about that. That is intentional to give it just, you know, some dimension and some um, neat look to them. And there's the bunny. I love how their hand, they're touching their noses and their hands are together in the heart. Here's the kitties. You know, we don't often have kitty things. I kind of like that Plown Hearth made sure that we had something for the cat lovers. And there they are. I'll turn them around so you can see how cute they are from all sides. 500 people are shopping right now in the moment. Uh, three easy payments of $8.81 and 64892. All here and all now. We've got more coming up in the second hour, second half hour of our Plow and Hour special here. We're live from Studio Park right now. It's our garden guy. More to come.